This is Sergeant Belt Fed, and we're playing some World of Warships. This is the aircraft carrier Graf Zeppelin. After the rework, in random. And look, Ma, where are my catapults? And here we are on Trap. And our favorite aircraft carrier, the Graf Zeppelin. Top tier in a... Uh, Tier 6, 7, and 8 game, sharing carrier duties with a Ranger. Now, Graf Zeppelin is still missing her bow catapults. Got these big trenches in the bow that my pilots are complaining about dodging. And this is the uh, dreaded carrier rework. Just looking at the... Uh, this position of the team, I'm suggesting B and C. We'll see how well that holds. Getting some ME-155s up to do a little spotting. Replay is a little choppy. I apologize for that. Not certain why the game was smooth. Let's do some dueling fighter drops. It's like our fighters are losing against their fighters. Of course, their fighters left too. Or, man, no, they're still there. Ah, Fabuki, let's go harass him. Join forces with the Ranger. Mm, broke two things, don't know what they were. Let's circle around. Let's result in a lot of rockets hitting this guy, hopefully. There's his rockets. There's ours. Took out his rudder and an AA gun. Circle back again. He's dropping smoke. More rockets. Rockets in the water this time. Awesome. Drop our spotter plane to keep him spotted and dump our last wave of rockets into the water. Of course. And we're on our way around the northern end of the map. Ranger hasn't started moving yet, but he will. Let's go get the torpedo bombers out. Let's go see if we can help out our T-61 here. I don't know what poor choice made him pink, but he's actually a pretty good player. So hats off to his effort. So we got fighter patrol over top of him. Hopefully it'll provide him a little protection. Now let's go see if we can go harass that Fabuki again. <laughs> some torpedoes over the island at him. Yeah, 
Somebody said carriers were ridiculous and overpowered and everything else. Well, so far, nobody has died. Let's go drop on this guy again. Try a little head-on drop. See if we'll get lucky. Go look behind us. He almost gets killed by a torpedo. Should call him up, see if he's got the serial number for it. Help me with my records. But somebody broke his engine. And now we're going to go try to drop on him. And boom! And he explodes right before our torpedoes get there. Oh well. But hey, his gyrations contributed to his uh, demise. Well, we spotted for 27,000 damage, done 2,800 of our own, and 313 points to airplanes. Oh, looks like our Prince Lincoln got uh, hit hard. <laughs> and that was the first ship to go down, and the only ship. Oh, Hagaid, who isn't moving. Go shoot some rockets at him. Let's run away. And the Rangers fighters are chasing us. And they are still chasing us. Okay. Looks like AA finished those off, so let's go back, go shoot the guy, eat some more. Looks like he's having a bad day. Got a hit, set him on fire, and he found a torpedo. Okay, we got a Massachusetts playing hero. This probably ain't going to work out well for him. He's pulling up to where looks like four or five enemy ships can shoot at him. Not much I can do to help him. Got a New Mexico that needs support. I'm going to go engage that lightning. I'm out of patrol fighters on my fighters anyways. I need capacity to something. some rockets into this guy again. Got one pin. And let's uh, let's launch some more torpedo planes. Okay, we just lost New Mexico to fire from the lightning. Lightning's going to go play in uh, the B cap. He's dragging and hit his friendly Otago with us. He's going to go mess with that T-61. And the New Mexico driver is salty. Hmm. Let's see where these things go. Got three hits on a North Carolina. Got the AA's murderous. Let's go throw some torps at the Prince Lincoln. Let's see about circling around. Of course, you're seven kilometers away and he's still firing. Let's see, do I want to circle around? Nah, let's not circle around. Their North Carolina went down to our Colorado. That's a good trade. Let's see if we can go uh, go cause a little damage.
Somebody's moving in on that Otago, I guess. Is that the Farragut? Yeah, gotta be the Farragut. It could be the T61. No, it's gotta be the Farragut. Because the T61's pink. Let's see how we're lining up. Fortunately, I don't have fighters. We spotted an aircraft carrier. Oh, no, we've been spotted. Let's go shoot some rockets into the superstructure of the Otago. Aha! And an almost dead lightning trying to cap. Well, we've shot down a total of five airplanes. Three of them ourselves, and our patrol fighters are shot down two. Now let's go throw in more torpedoes. So now we've done 24,000 damage, done 5,400 to aircraft, 91,000. Uh, damage tanked and 76,000 damage spotted. Let's go make an easy drop on a Colorado here. Should get, should get a couple of hits out of this. <laughs> okay, got one hit. ran aground. Well, don't feel like flying back into the AA, so let's get these airplanes back. Let's go drop our torps on the Colorado. Maybe we'll get lucky. Let's wait a second. Okay. The Agnavoy shelled the Colorado to death, probably before the torpedoes hit. And we have a full flight of dive, torpedo bombers again, sorry. The aircraft carrier's been detected by the enemy. Ask me if I care. We spotted for 94,000 damage. Nothing else has really changed. Let's go see if we can smack the Otago. He knows we're onto him. He's going to turn. There's our drop. Let's loop around inside his turn. He took a hit. His turn killed his speed. All right, and it's like, say, dodge this. Kablam, two more hits. Chuck those things over top of an island. Let's go run up, because we've got patrol fighters on us. And dump them for the hipper. And the Otago has perished. Let's go make a run on the New Mexico. Of course, 
course, the New Mexico swings his butt into them and eats all three. So we backed off the island. Let's get this show on the road again. Eh, I don't know how amazing the Torp Graps have been. It's got to be talking about the Ranger. Eh, he's been okay. Yeah, New Mexico is going to perish, so let's not bother. There's the Helena. Rangers eating AA up high, so hopefully it gives us a good drop. And that was a little close. And we whiffed. So let's see if we can smack him coming over the island. First, the ranger smacked him. Start a run. He'll drop us down below the island. Nice thing is if you go come over islands. It lessens the effect of a lot of the AA, because AA has uh, altitude, and that really didn't do us any good, so we didn't bother dropping, and the Helena has gone down. So the, all that's left is a Bajani, a badly wounded Lexington, and an intact Ranger. First, the Ranger and Lexington have aircraft outbound. We're going to repair some uh, damage to our airplanes, and we're going to start making runs on the Lexington. Bounce the airplanes off the wall. In case you're curious, hugging the side of the map does not do you any good anymore. So, almost killed the Lexington. I've got a badly damaged airplane, a damaged airplane, and one good one. Lost the badly damaged one. Got the torp drop. Interesting bug. Let's get back to the ship. And got ourselves a kill. Here we are. Over 4,000 gross experience. Almost half a million gross credits. 851 free experience. Only did 67,000 damage. You don't see a lot of really, really high damage totals with the new carriers. Some people can do it. I'm not one of them. 14 torpedo hits. I would hope that would be more than 67,000 damage, but uh-uh, you ain't getting that. Uh, nine rockets, never launched the dive bombers, uh, two ships destroyed, by various means, a total of six uh, aircraft shot down, two floodings, but that didn't matter, three flags defended, that's always nice, started two fires, six incapacitations, and eight spotteds. Got some stuff on missions done. Came in, miraculously enough, second overall to a Colorado. So, that's a good ship. Well, I don't know if it's a good ship, but definitely a good skipper. Uh, overall, team did rather well. The Helena on the other team uh, did extremely well himself. He'd have placed rather nicely over here. Got the kill on the Lexington. Finished off that Lightning... Did a fair amount of damage to the Otago. Scratched the paint on North Carolina. Put a dent, little tiny dent in New Mexico. Even smaller dent in the Colorado. We hit something else. But uh, 14 aircraft torpedoes for 52,000 damage. Nine rockets for 10,000. They're doing over 1,000 points each. Wow, that's nice. Uh, two fires for a whopping 101. Uh, floodings, two for not quite 3,800. That's not bad. Lost 26 of our own airplanes. Uh, was hit by a single torpedo for 
5,000 and change. So, obviously an aircraft torpedo. Shot down one patrol fighter and five torpedo bombers. Spotted for 102,000 damage. Spotted for three fires. Tank 19,000. Spotted one warship. 17 squadrons and three torpedoes. Note, we do not spot torpedoes with our airplanes, so yeah, we saw those ourselves. Got 10 defense points, captured nothing. Match ran for 17 minutes, and we traveled 55.22 kilometers. So yes, I know where my engine is in this ship. Hmm. Made a net of just over 400,000 credits. Got uh, 6,900 or so Commander's XP. Rather nice. I'm getting a little better with the aircraft carriers, especially the Graf Zeppelin, because she's always fun. Uh, dive bombers are still next to useless. Getting a little better with my torpedo drops. Still every now and then dropping them a little too close. But... Uh, Getting better at leading stuff. Wish they were a little quicker. I'd consider torp acceleration, but I don't think it helps at all. Because it means you have to drop 5% further back. Which would kind of suck. <laughs> oh well. See you on the next one.